This is an initiative that the Oncology Nursing Society has been involved with for over 15 years. And it started through a grant through the National Institutes of Health, uh, through NCI, and it was really a way to try to not only bring uh, current cancer care to the Middle East, but also palliative care and also kind of peacekeeping. So we have, you know, a lot of different countries. We work with like 19 different countries. The gentleman who started the Middle Eastern Cancer Consortium is Professor Michael Silberman, who is a physician out of Israel. So we have uh, a man from Israel, a physician from Israel, really trying to engage Islamic people, you know, in this initiative. That started over 15 years ago, has been highly successful, um, and we've made several trips. We've, uh, Turkey was kind of a meeting ground. We met there every year looking at needs for palliative care for the Middle East. We set up a, or a, a clinical trials network, but the most recent uh, project that we've been working on is palliative care. Well, unfortunately, the Middle Eastern Cancer Consortium lost funding a couple of years ago, but now the Omani Cancer Association has really picked up the project, and Dr. Wahid al Harusi has really um, now led that initiative. So Professor Silberman, you know, passed the baton to him, and so that's kind of the training area that we're going to. We're going to uh, Muscat Oman, and again, we bring other countries in. So this last training, we had uh, Pakistan, Iran, Iraq, Egypt, Saudi Arabia, Jordan. Um, I'm sure there's many others, Turkey, Palestine. So a lot of different people from the Middle East. And we actually trained about 180 nurses from around the region.